Good morning. It is Wednesday, October 20th, and I have today off work because this morning I had whatever dentist appointment thingy. So uh, I've gone, I've done that, everything's fine, teeth are good, not falling out yet, so, so far so good, eh? Uh, <laughs> but I don't really know what else I got going on today, I don't really make plans, but for the time being, on my way home at least, I'm gonna try and figure out something to pick up to, to eat. And I'm gonna go try Crazy Bowls and Wraps. I've never had Crazy Bowls and Wraps, but I have had a gift card for Crazy Bowls and Wraps since April of last year. Um, just after like, I think it was Easter, uh, my church gave it to me. I've never been. I'll go today. So having never been to Crazy Bowls and Wraps before, I figured I'd be crazy not to get both a bowl and a wrap. <laughs> and the gift card covered it. So I got their fajita bowl and a buffalo wrap, both of them with jasmine rice and uh, the whatever the normal chicken, the chicken that didn't add extra cost. Um, so it feels a little like you know, as far as like what the product is, it's the kind of things like you'd get at a Chipotle or Qdoba or there's another one, um, that kind of thing. Um, but it's not like a bar where you're making selections. You choose like a this item from the menu and you just choose what kind of rice and what kind of protein and then what kind of tortilla for the wrap. Uh, I got flour because I'm normal. <laughs> but yeah, so I'm going to give these a shot. Not bad. Not bad. Um, I probably preferred the buffalo wrap but then I like I like buffalo a lot uh, and definitely only if you get an extra cup of the buffalo sauce from their forget what they call it but they have like a sauce bar which has little cups of salsa and stuff for the chips and they had buffalo so I was like I'll just grab one just in case and I'm very glad I did it needed extra buffalo sauce because uh, there was not very much on there um, the bowl it was it was good it was good as well um, particularly once I added some of the salsas and mixed it up, because if you just start picking from the top, it's, it's not, it's not, not as good, um, but I guess obviously you're supposed to probably mix it up. Um, the bowl seemed like more food, just between the two of them, although I like the taste of tortilla, so I, I, I like the, the wrap still, um. I'm pretty sure that, I mean, it had black beans on it, which I don't usually care for, but they were good. I don't know. I've only given them a chance, like, maybe twice ever and not liked them, but I tried them there and I liked them, so. Um, but yeah, so. It's not gonna, by any means, like, replace Chipotle or something. Um, I probably won't go very much, but it probably won't be the last time I ever go. Um... Because it was alright, just for something for variety. And supposedly it's like, I don't know if it's healthier or more sustainable. Like there's some sort of higher level benefit that they're like, oh, you should do this because of this. Whatever. Still, tasted good, so. That's alright. One of their salsas was bland. I don't remember what that one was called. It wasn't the the um, the jalapeno cilantro one was good, and then I had another one, and that one wasn't very. It was just bland. I mean, it was wasn't bad. It was just lacking in flavor. <laughs> um, yeah, so I gave crazy bowls and wraps a shot. Whatever you know, needed to do for a while. Have that gift card. Okay, it is now like just after noon. So hopefully get some some stuff accomplished today, but I don't really know what. 
and I decided to unbox my Cree colony. Check out the burrows. And so now I got burrows. It's a new environment, new type of setting of Dwarven Forge, earthen tunnels. It's very brown. It's, you know, with a little gray. Gray is our splash of color. Um, <laughs> But I wanted to get it just to have the environment, and I got it as the Cree colony so that I got probably all I'll end up needing until they do some sort of expansion on it. And it doesn't need much of an expansion. Um, might be cool to have some things that turn 45 degrees so we can offset parts of it. Um, and then just some interesting bits, flashy bits, reasons to be down there. Something like that would be cool. Someday, maybe. But uh, but for now, I've got burrows. So I got that unboxed, really just to make it where I've, I've caught up on my unboxings again before my next batch of Dwarven Forge arrives in probably a few more days. <laughs> uh, keep from getting too far behind, I guess. <sighs> what time is it? So I certainly have editing I can do. Only 2.45. Turn away, I might try record some Zelda. Even if I only get one or two, it might be worth just putting a little effort towards that. So I did record a couple episodes of Zelda. Uh, between that and the, the unboxing, I'm, I, I did all right to, to get some stuff accomplished here on my spare day off in the middle of the week. You know, definitely more, you know, could be done with if I'd prepared and such, but I didn't. I just, you know, took the day off because I needed to for the dentist. And really didn't make any preparations for how I was using the rest of the day. But I managed to get some stuff done, and so that's good. Now, I was kind of looking forward to, like, watching Dwarven Forge lives on the anvil this evening, but they canceled it. Again. I think it's the, is it the second or third week in a row? They're preparing, they're in like a week and a half or two weeks or whatever, they're, they're launching a, a Kickstarter, and it's a small Kickstarter, but um, they're having to put a lot of work into getting it ready, it seems. So, oh well. So I don't know what I'm doing with my evening now, but I've, I've accomplished some stuff. I'm not going to stress out about trying to do more relax for the evening. That should be the goal. So I made uh, pasta for dinner. Uh, I did get all the burrows documented and put away. I even edited like half a vlog. Otherwise I've been lazing about for a bit. And at this point I'm gonna change just being lazy to going to bed and call it a night. Thank you for joining me and joining me as my journey continues. Bye. <laughs>